everybody, it's Lon Seibin, and the folks from Top G sent me this little thermometer to review. This is a handheld thing that you point at surfaces, and it'll tell you what the temperature of those surfaces are. So you, as you can see, it's uh, rather chilly here in my basement studio, which is why sometimes I talk so fast, because I'm trying to get out of here so I can warm up again. Uh, hopefully in the summer it'll get a little bit warmer, but uh, it's pretty simple to operate. You have a couple of controls in the front here. You can switch it uh, to Celsius or Fahrenheit. Uh, you have the ability to turn off the laser pointer, so if you don't want to shine the laser beam in people's eyes, you can just turn that off and it'll uh, not put that on. Uh, you also have a backlight for the display, and that's pretty much how it works. Uh, the way it works is that it has a little infrared sensor on the front here, and it's measuring uh, the amount of, of infrared energy that it's seeing to determine what the temperature is. It does get thrown off if you point it at like a toaster oven or something with the glass closed. Uh, it'll measure you know, what the surface of that glass is. It doesn't really get the temperature inside the oven until you open it up. Um, but I found generally it's working pretty good. What they recommend in the manual is that you want to have whatever you're measuring kind of fill, uh, fill up its field of vision. And they have kind of a little diagram here to give you some ideas to how to do that. Um, but I did find it you know, works pretty well. It's fairly accurate and um, you know, was able to point it at things and get the temperature. Uh, what these things are useful for, um, you know, for, for me at least, would be testing like the walls to make sure you don't have you know, electric sockets that are heating up too much and that sort of thing. A uh, good way to kind of get a real quick surface temperature of something. Uh, doesn't, you, know, you can't really use it to test your own temperature. It's not really designed for that. It's more of an industrial kind of use. But uh, it's a pretty neat little product, and I think I'll use it around the house quite a bit. It even comes with a 9-volt battery too, so you have everything you need right out of the box. So that is the Top G Infrared Thermometer, and this is Lon Seibin. Thanks for watching.